guys! It is Moonsault Stables. I am back with another video and today it is actually not a Briarfest video this time. I know we're only less than two weeks away from Briarfest, but I got an exciting new horse in so I wanted to unbox her on camera for you. So just recently Briar released a new web special which actually negated pretty much all of my surprise speculation video. If you would like to check out that surprise speculation video, I will link that in the description down below so you can see who I think the surprise model will be. However, this model right here does change my top guess, but <laughs> it is still going to be exciting to see who ends up being the surprise horse. So anyways, this new web special is Meadowlark, and she is the new Birds of a Feather series web special. Now, I did not actually win her myself. I actually got her from a, another seller. I was able to do a trade for her, so super excited for that. And so let's go ahead and get her on open for you guys. And apparently she came with a catalog. All right. All right. Here she is in her bubble wrap. So let's go ahead, get her opened on up. I am super excited to see her. I was so excited for her when I saw the entry open up. I was like, I know Briarfest is so close away, but I need to get this horse somehow. <laughs> Oh, she is so pretty already. I haven't even opened her head yet. All right, so here is Meadowlark officially all opened up out of her Briar packaging. Now this is the first web special I have purchased in <laughs> quite some time. I don't think I have won a web special since Zion and Moab in 2017, so it's been a hot minute. So definitely was very excited to get this girl. Again, I was, I entered for her on my own account, didn't get her, so very, very, very grateful for that reseller that was able to trade for her. So let's go ahead and take a look at her. I haven't actually even looked at her since taking her out of the package, so. She is just gorgeous. Oh, that's cute. It actually has a little meadow lark on there. And I'll throw up a picture of the actual bird up here somewhere. But she is really, really nice. I absolutely love Palomino Pintos, so that's why I was so excited for her. She's a Palomino Pinto. She has these just gorgeous blue eyes that I'm just absolutely in love with. Oh, that little kissy spot. I love it. She is really nice. She's got like kind of funky like masking at the bottom of her mane, but that's the only thing I can really see on her that's not perfect. But again, that's just me being nitpicky. So I am quite pleased with her and she will go so, so well with all of my other Palominos that I own in my collection. And by the way, that does remind me, I will be doing a collection tour again for 2021 after Briarfest, I'll plan on doing a post Briarfest collection tour once I have all of my Briarfest models in, including like my Artisans Gallery models, if I'm able to snag any of those. So look forward to that. Hopefully in like August, maybe September, not totally sure yet, but we'll see what happens. But anyways, <laughs> here is Meadowlark. Just absolutely 
gorgeous, gorgeous model. And again, a Bluegrass Bandit was originally my initial guess for the surprise horse this year. I was really hoping it was going to be her, but since we now have a web special of Bluegrass Bandit, that kind of gets rid of that theory, because typically if there's a model released within roughly the six or seven months before Briarfest, that mold most likely will not be a surprise horse. So I doubt we'll see Bluegrass Bandit, but that still leaves my other two guesses up and running. And again, you can see my surprise video to see those guesses that I had. So I'm hoping it's gonna be one of those, but we'll see, we'll find out. <laughs> but yeah, let me know you guys, were you able to get a meadow lark. Have you had any of the other Birds of a Feather models? Again, this is my first model that I have from the Birds of a Feather series, which I absolutely love. I just haven't been able to get any yet, and they are very, very pricey on the secondary market, so I don't buy any, but... <laughs> but yeah, she is gorgeous. I'm in love with her. I can't wait until we can see what she looks like on my shelves in my next collection tour. But yeah, don't forget to comment down below on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already to see more model horse videos, including a whole lot of Briarfest unboxings coming up soon. And I will see you next time.